The following diagram shows the cross section of the roof of a house. It is given that it's symmetrical about the line AE. The gradient of the line BA is 7 over 12. Question A. Find the size of the angle BAE. What does this gradient mean? It means that if x increases by 1, y changes by this value. Here, y increases by 7 over 12. And you can see that we can deduce a tangent of this angle. Theta is 7 over 12 uh, divided by 1 or just 7 over 12. Or in general, gradient is rise over run or y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 for any two points on the line. And it means that for any two points there will be always the same ratio change in y to change in x. And here it's 7 to 12. It means in parts it may be 70 to 150 and so on. So we can deduce that tangent of the angle theta is 7 over 12. And in general it's useful to remember that for a given line tangent of the angle between the line and the positive direction of x-axis, uh, it means uh, this part of x-axis to the right, is equal to the gradient of the line. When line is decreasing it looks like this. So tangent theta is equal to the gradient of the line. So here we can just draw a horizontal line here to get a right angle triangle is because A is vertical and we draw a horizontal line and for this angle theta tangent of theta is 7 over 12. It's because for example for, for these two points ratio rise uh, to run it's 7 to 12 or change in y to change in x it's uh, 7 to 12 or it's a line and it's positive direction of x-axis to the right so tangent of this angle theta is 7 over 12 and the required angle BAE can be found as 90 degrees minus inverse tangent or arctangent of 7 uh, over 12 degrees uh, required here or it can be found directly you can see that for BAE tangent of BAE is 12 over 7 so tangent of BAE is 12 over 7 hence BAE is just inverse tangent or arctangent of 12 over 7 And it's 59.7 degrees to three significant figures. The next question B find CE and BA. And we can see that CE can be found as CD, it's 50 plus DE and since uh, AE it's a line of symmetry, D it's DF it's a horizontal line, so DE uh, and something it's a right angle triangle, and since uh, DF it's a horizontal line, so this angle it's also theta, or this angle is equal to the found BAE, and uh, due to symmetry uh, this it's 300 and 50 and we can find DE if we consider sine of this angle which is equal to BAE and sine of BAE it's opposite over hypotenuse we can see the sine of this angle but it is equal to BAE and it's 300 
and 50 divided by DE. Hence, CE becomes 50 plus DE, it's 350 divided by sine of BAE. Three hundred and fifty divided by sine of the answer, and then plus fifty. And it's four hundred and fifty five centimeters. And to find BA, BA, you can see that BA and CE are parallel, so let it be. M, you can see that BA is BM plus MA, but BM it's, uh, it is equal to CE, so it's CE plus MA, and MA can be found from right angle triangle, this AME, and it is equal that it, it's 30, it's also 30 because we draw a height EM, it's also perpendicular, and BAE is known. Hence, we can consider what tangent of can see the tangent of B A E and it's opposite it's 30 over A or M A M A so M A it's 30 divided by tangent so it's C E C E plus divided by tangent of B A E so it's answer plus 30 divided by oh, tangent but tangent of B A E it's directly it's directly what 12 over 7 and it's Four hundred and seventy three four hundred and seventy three centimeters to three significant figures. And that's all for this question.